Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new episode of, well, me being in Florida. And today I wanted to share with you a, a really cool thing which is called the Mystery Tackle Box. And my brother's uh, patient, they ended up um, gifting him this service. It's something really cool for, there are different packages for $20 a month, once a week I believe. Um, they'll send you this mystery package. Again, I'm not sponsored by them or anything. I just learned about this and I just wanted to share it with you. So every week or every month, you will get one of these boxes. This is the Pro Edition. Ooh. And uh, you can select which type you want. You want the sea fishing, you want the bass fishing, the walleyes and stuff like that. So I just wanted to unpack it and share with you guys what you get in it because it is so cool and it's all a mystery so this bass fishing kit you're gonna get all bass related stuff and it's actually a really good deal so this is the box okay uh, what's inside it tells you the different lures and uh, it gives you hints and stuff and cool things like that in every box um, so, like we have this, this casting jig for bass, this is a frog, ooh, I should try these tonight, and, uh, look at this thing, isn't this cool? Tickle, yodel worm, and we have a few different things, we have hooks, and we have this worm thing. Um, on to the other boxes. Let me just throw this in. The next box is the Pro. Uh, this is for fishing, uh, salt water, I guess. And uh, it has... <laughs> it has a scale. And then, okay, my brother put these in. These are not included in the box. These two guys, not included in the box, okay. Uh, Long John New Edition. Look at this, explosive injection of scent and taste. Uh, it's a shrimp formula, I'm assuming. And uh, if you want to actually buy these, it will actually even give you the prices. How much they are each. Uh, so this is so cool. And then you have shrimp, obviously, uh, for sea fishing in Florida, which I am going in a few days. Uh, we're going to be using live shrimps and we're actually not going to be using any of these lures. Because uh, live bait is king. Every time I've gone sea fishing, a live bait just kills it out of the park. Look at this, 3 odd and 4 odd hooks. I actually know what this size means. Before I had no idea. And then we have more shrimps. Big bite saltwater baits. Big bite on your line. Uh, so that is super cool. Look at this. Squid Liquid Mayhem. Bonus. Look at this. They even give you a fresh series bottle. And then uh, this is my favorite thing. Look at this crab. I kind of want to do fishing for bass with this little crab sea thing. Uh, Coco the crab. But this is so cool. Um, so inside this box, again, they have tips and tricks, a uh, fold-up strong garbage bag known as a contractor bag, you can make it a rain a poncho tarp or place to temporarily ta transport fish. And then they go about best places in Florida to fish for certain types of fish, fluorocarbon line. Uh, fishing has a sticker price that steers many novices from bargaining racks to monofilament. Even though fluorocarbon is uh, better for bass, it says because it gets you more bites. Uh, obviously because of the invincibility of the line as well as more um, sensitivity. So really cool stuff in there. Uh, what else do we got? Aha! Where is Coco the crab? I hope you can see this. My fingers. Uh, Liquid Mayhem I just showed you guys is $7.50, Big Bite Shrimp, uh, where is that crab? I don't see the crab, so not everything is listed, uh, but it's really cool, so they, they give you the sticker, 
Ooh, look at this. Where to fish? Bucktail jig. Uh, grass flat. Uh, what is this? Grass flat, flat, seawall. Uh, line 10 to 15 pound of fluorocarbon. Damn. How is uh, there's 10 to 15 pound fluorocarbon or 30 to 40 pound braided? Isn't braided stronger than fluorocarbon? Okay, enough of that. We need to unbox another box. I'm just gonna throw all this stuff here. Really cool. It's just amazing. If you are, I guess, new to fishing or even if you are like amateur or medium I don't know um, this box is really cool if you're a pro I guess you know exactly what you want right so this is the third box right now again we have a fish here look at these Scandinavia headlights ah what is this uh, named after Latin name of the smelt uh, optimized flexibility realistic eyes and painted detailed color not for human consumption thank you very much I did not know that look at this guy this guy's so heavy uh, Al's goldfish saltwater series this guy looks like he's gonna be excellent in saltwater because he's gonna be shining a lot and a lot of the predatory fish are gonna love this guy I feel like again what do I know uh, series hook uh, where is this hook what? Where, where's this hook? There are eight of them. I have no idea where it went. Um, Cajun? Mad Mina Buya Shad. Oh, I think I saw the price for this. Oh, you know what? So those papers are just mixed up in all other boxes. So I was probably looking at uh, the prices for this box. Okay, we have the shad tail. This is cool. Look at this watermelon color. I kind of want to eat it. <laughs> Ooh, look at this salt runner bo Bosca. Is this guy must be the Bosca? No, this is Larry Bosca. Oh yeah, it is him. Look at his blue shades. But this is interesting, isn't it? It's like a worm. It kind of swims. And it has the spinny thing. The other one doesn't though. This is cool. Easy to fish. Just cast and use a slow retrieval. Vibration sound bait profile is a deadly combination. No extra action is needed. Ooh. For a simpleton like me, this is perfect. Slow retrieval, perfect. I don't gotta do jig step or any of those things. Okay, what do we got here? We got this huge worm. <clears throat> It has a very interesting tail. Thick tail, minnow 5 inch. Man, these are for some big fish. Oh yeah. We got these jig heads. Uh, we got these uh, OWG hook. 4 odd size. Damn. I don't know if my... I don't know if my... Um, my rod and reels are going to be able to handle such big fish. Okay, and then... See these? These are all the hooks. So they're not in their bag anymore. They all fell over. And then this is the sticker from the Scandinavia. Scandinavia, right? Yeah. So uh, there you go. Some seriously cool stuff. Um, as for what's happening with me in Florida for the week I am here, um, I've been fishing from the backyard every day. Crap. And uh, yesterday was the best day. I ended up catching bass. Uh, I unhooked a few bass. And I also ended up catching a, um, a gar. Uh, it was a little baby. Uh, but I don't think they're going to get any bigger in this, uh, in this lake here. So I'll just spin the camera around and show you guys.
<laughs> uh, so yeah, this is the lake I've been fishing. Uh, and topwater lure is king. The biggest bass I've caught were on uh, live worm. Uh, so I'm gonna keep fishing every day. I'm getting my camera work all, you know, optimized. And hopefully Thursday and Friday sea fishing. So let's see how that goes. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Just wanted to update you guys. And um, yeah, I'm away from my computer, so I cannot edit videos. So those fishing videos are gonna come out in maybe two to three weeks. Anyway, guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. I will see you guys soon enough. Bye.